Operation Talon Steel. Men identified as working for Gospic have killed an Interpol agent who had infiltrated their operation and seized control of an airport on Cayman Brac. Their baggage, which has been recovered, contains aerosol dispersal equipment intended for use with the blistering agent, the existence of which has been confirmed. Your mission is to secure the airport and neutralize all gunmen. Hello YouTube and welcome back. We are getting back to the um, airport or airfield again. Um, this time we're going to neutralize all terrorists, which may basically mean to run around and shoot some bad editors. And that's what we're going to do. So we don't want a plan for this. We're going to make one. Uh, we're on mission 13. Um, it's assault. Uh, there's going to be some fairly close quarter, I'd imagine. And uh, there's some big open areas. So we are going to want assault and a sniper for this. Uh, there's not going to be too much leaning and sneers. Leaning? Too much sneaking and peeking. So um, we're going to take our usual assault teams. Uh, Eddie Price, uh, we're going to take uh, Ding Chavez as green leader. Uh, I think we're going to take two teams of three and a team of two again on this. So uh, we're looking for our uh, Timothy Hanley. He's going to go on here and we are going to take Jörg Volta. Uh, we then want our other two guys for gold team. Uh, Daniel Bogart, don't forget, died. It was very sad when that happened. I was genuinely upset about that because um, we've gone through so much of the game without losing anybody and then suddenly there's one guy and I didn't go back and replay the mission. So even though he's available here because we're... Um, we're using the uh, unlock all code to unlock the levels because the previous levels got lost when I installed uh, uh, Raven Shield 2 and then um, reinstalled the original. Didn't want to play for all the missions again to get back to where I was, so that's basically what happened there. So uh, we want a sniper. Uh, we're going to take. Doo -doo -doo. Who are we going to have? Dr. Babe is pretty good, so is Homer Johnson. Who's got leadership? Maybe we'll take. You know what? I might take a uh, sniper. I think we're going to take her. Leadership ATA, and then we're going to have a look at our recon. See how our recon are doing. I think we'll take uh, Tracy Wu on recon <coughs> with, uh, with Gold Team. Okay, weapons. Now, there are some fairly big areas. I'm going to take, um, I'm going to stick with the G36 uh, for the main weapon. Um, I'm not going to bother suppressing it because I don't need to. And to be honest, if we spook them and they start charging us, it, all the better for us as far as I'm concerned. It, what it means is that we get them um, a bit a bit closer to us uh, for close quarter um, fighting. I'm going to give him the um, MP5 MP510 with a, a scope. And I'm going to give your daughter the He's going to take an M4, even though he's German, is he German? He's going to take an M4 uh, again with a scope. Ding is going to take an M4 with a scope. He doesn't have a P90, what the hell? Uh, where is he? M4 uh, or an M16. Okay, we're going to stick with an M4, even though the M16 presumably has a, a better range. Um, we are... Uh, Louis Le Cell is going to take the uh, he's going to take the G36. Uh, again, he's going to take no um, no silencer because he doesn't need it. And we are going to give Alexandra Norma Norma Norma. If anybody can pronounce that, feel free to tell me. Um, I'm going to give him the the M82. Let's give him the M82 and we'll take a look at it. Uh, I think uh, M82. Yeah, and I will give him a scope on that as well. Uh, pistols, we don't need any. any um, frags, 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 frags. 
so uh, we don't need silencers on a pistol, so I'm going to take frag grenades, so we're going to say that, that, that for all of our t guys in this team. Uh, we're going to take Euro Camo Heavy, and that will go to all our guys in this team and there as well. Uh, you know what, I'm going to give Timothy Hanley a heartbeat sensor, because if we get to a point where we're running around and unsure of where we're going, what we're doing, then um, uh, you know if we end up with one guy who we're trying to find, that uh, obviously works in our favour to have a heartbeat sensor. Um, and give him frags, going to supply that to everybody, then Louise, uh, Louis Loisin is then going to take a U. What am I doing? What am I doing, YouTube? Heartbeat sensor. Uh, sniping. I want a covert. I want some for silence for this because I don't want them coming charging after um, after our snipers, uh, sniper team. Okay, we're going to take a suppressor. Uh, no, we're not. It's a covert, so it's already fairly quiet. So, yeah, it's already fairly quiet. So we're going to uh, uh, have no attachment on there. Uh, we're going to take a suppressor on our pistol. And do we want smoke there? You know what? I'm going to leave smoke with with this. Uh, they're going to take light. They're both going to be in light green uh, camo or light light euro camo. Was it euro camo? Light euro camo <coughs> for these guys. And we Tracy is going to take. Actually, you know what? I'm going to stick with the MP5 KPDW or. They're gonna, she's going to have a UMP45 again, it's going to be suppressed um, and silence on there. And I'm going to give her some frags because you never know. So that's it, that's our team selection um, and weapon selection. We're not going silenced except for um, our sniper team who are quiet and sneaky. We're going to save this plan as M13, yes, and then we're going to go to the planning room. This may well be a, a slightly longer video than normal, um, and I hope that nobody minds that. Uh, I know watching the planning phases on these isn't the most exciting thing that can happen, um, but hey ho, if you enjoy it, then good. We are okay. We've got one insertion point on this. I've not actually played this mission through um, before making the video, so this this should be interesting. Uh, okay, well we, we we know the layout because we came here in a previous mission, and um, so we're going to take our red team. Well, all our teams are going to um, insert here. So our red team is going to be our main team that we're going to work with, and we will flick through the other teams as we um, play the game. So red team, I basically want them to come up here, um, around here. I'm going to get them to come in and clear this room. Uh, they're going to go through here and clear out these rooms and then come out of here. My, my aim is basically I'm going to probably keep the teams working together for the most of this um, map. They, they will come out of here uh, and I will then have them up here and heading you know, facing over in that direction, covering that. So our green team who are going to cover them from a distance are going to insert here. They are going to come up to, well, they're going to come up here I think, um, maybe around here and they're then going to wait for uh, Alpha, at which point they'll do nothing. They will. They'll take. Uh, they'll have alpha, and then I want them to move up to this position, where again they will have alpha, and they'll do nothing. Um, but I want them to kind of cover down in that direction, so they can cover the door and uh, around by the ambulances. Gold are going to start here as well. Here we go. They are going to head to here. Um, where they're going to have, let's have a look and see where they can see. So they can actually see all the way down there. Now we've got a sniper in here, so we're going to go for 
uh, Alpha again, and we're going to say snipe, and I want them to just snipe as far up here as they can uh, in that direction. So that's the uh, that's the plan so far. Um, in fact, actually, I want to change that go code to. Um, I'm going to change it to Charlie. We're going to keep the snipe team separate. They're going to have um, Charlie and they are going to snipe down to this direction and you know what I'm going to change my go codes for green as well because I want green I'm going to have alpha team as red bravo team as charlie and um, bravo team as green and charlie as gold uh, so I'm confusing myself out a bit <laughs> never mind so back to red. <coughs> so we are here. Red are then going to head up to this door and we are going to go in and clear inside. We're going to clear this way. We're then going to clear that way. And we are then going to head round to here. Now while green team, uh, sorry, while red team are heading round to here, um, and coming round, I want them to come upstairs and basically come through here, clear this room, uh, clear around by that window. And then while they're doing that, I want the green team, who are going to have the Bravo Goko by this point, to head over in this direction, keeping covering over there. Um, they're going to head over here to where we've got some crosses. I'm not entirely sure why I've got the crosses on here. To oh, maybe that just shows where the patrol or possible patrol points are for the um, for the bad editors. They're going to head over this way. Uh, they're going to head to here, and they are going to. Oh wait, no, they're not. Okay, normal. They're going to head to this door. They're going to wait. <coughs> Bravo. They're going to do nothing. Um, then once they've had the Bravo go code, they're going to head inside this building. They're going to head round here, up these stairs, and I want them to clear, clear, clear. And I think they will then uh, basically just sort of stay, stay there where they are. So Gold Team, who are going to work with them, are going to come up to here, on Charlie. Uh, they are going to Charlie and Snipe, uh, Snipe, Snipe, and they're going to snipe down in this direction. Once they've got the Charlie Go code, I want them to work their way round to here. Now, what can we see down there? I think they actually want to be on this side a bit, don't they? Now, what can we see? That's better. Um, and I'm going to give them Charlie again. <laughs> And we're going to have them snipe down in this direction again. And basically just offering cover. <laughs> then red team, having having cleared out, they are going to come outside here. They're going to come up here. They're going to clear these rooms out. They're going to head back downstairs. This is... Um, you know, this is going to go on for a bit. Uh, we're going to come round through these doors. We are going to come out here, clearing our way through. We're then going to enter this building. Now, when I get here, I want to uh, do a milestone and uh, frag. I want to frag in through. Well, I want to frag in through this door um, before heading in, and we're basically going to go through, clearing out downstairs. Uh, green team should by now have cleared out the upstairs. Um, so provided no one's died horribly, we should, in theory, have uh, cleared out everything and everyone on this map. So that's what I'm hoping for. I'm going to save this plan again as M13. So yeah, we'll say yes. Uh, we'll head over to our loadout page. And that's it. So we shall see how this goes, having not played through... Um, previously to have a look at the map 
uh, it'll be an interesting one so thank you very much for watching guys thank you very much for your support and for commenting on my previous videos and your input I really do appreciate it and I hope that you are enjoying the series and I hope that you will enjoy it again in the future so thank you very much guys cheers bye bye